Hey, this is Kevin Davidson at Mindful Masculinity. Now, we're starting a series of short videos that are going to be streamed twice a week on a Thursday and a Monday. And we're going to be covering topics that come up in the coaching sessions that I have with guys. I'm going to call the Thursday, the Thursday Thoughts, and Monday, broadcast the Monday Mantra. Today's Thursday Thought is about poor role models. Guys come to me and share the impact their father has had on them in terms of their masculinity and being a man into adulthood. They also share about uh, their mothers as well. But today we're just going to concentrate on fathers. The sort of stories that they relate to me is their fathers telling them that they're not tough enough, they need to man up, they're acting like a sissy, they need to take control. And when they showed any signs of sensitivity and weakness to their fathers, they said it was met with real hostility. Some were punished and some were shouted at. And this has impacted them going into their adulthood. And we're not just talking about people in their 20s and 30s. We're talking about people in their 50s and 60s. That's the sort of impact that it can have on a person. Now, therapy can help because it will be able to allow you, if you've had this experience, to understand and bring some context as to what happened. But when people ask me, I say there's a real opportunity here. You can't change what your father said to you. You can't change the past. But what you can do is change your thinking. It's about taking ownership and responsibility and defining what's good for you in your life, defining yourself as a man, defining your sense of masculinity. Because it allows you then to attract new people into your life that aligns with that new belief. Because back then you were trying to seek the approval of your father, but it never happened. But what you don't realise is that you're still doing that and the people you attract into your life are like your father because you want to uh, seek their approval because it will then make the past, you know, it will heal the past. But what happens is that it's a vicious cycle. You keep attracting those type of people because you want to try and approve them, get their approval rather. By changing your beliefs and taking responsibility and taking ownership, you will now attract the people that you want in life to support your new thinking of masculinity. So take ownership, take responsibility and define who you are as a man because that will heal and change the past and take away the poor role model influence it's had on you in being a man today.